this is Garden Talk Jamaican. Just want to share with you the progress of my Stokes Purpose Sweet Potato, which I placed in this container on the 31st of January. First, I had it covered with leaf mold, and that wasn't doing much, so I had to place it in soil instead. And then I noticed that the roots were pretty long. It seems purple sweet potatoes grow long roots and they are robust roots. So you have to place them in quite a bit of soil. Here I have in this container, it's a pretty big ice cream container. Yes, ice cream. We use up those old containers, don't we? And it has at least three inches of soil. Another thing I do, which, you know, is working for me, so it should work for you too, if you try it, maybe, you tent it with a plastic bag, punch holes in the bags, so that you have that condensation going and that greenhouse humidity effect. And also, you spread it with water because the, if you have it on a heating mat, it dries out the soil pretty quickly. So spritz it with water every day and don't dunk the water in it. Use a spray bottle. I do that. That's just me anyway because I don't want to drown the potato and have it rotting on me because there's too much water in the container. And of course, I do have holes in the container too to get rid of any excess water. And another thing I do with it is just keep it going and have the lights on it. I have it inside with grow lights. Uh, so that is what I do with this. If you're inspired by this video, then please give it a like. And even better, subscribe. Let me give you a much closer look. Here we go. Here is Mr. Purple Sweet Potato yeah and i will keep you updated on its progress when i'm ready to detach the sprouts and put them in water i will share another video with you and that have a wonderful day bye